Hello guys, welcome to the next video tutorial on Bootstrap tutorial for beginners. In the last video, we have seen what is a grid system in Bootstrap and how we can use containers in Bootstrap. Now in this video, we will see how we can insert rows and columns inside our container in Bootstrap. So last time I have told you that each Bootstrap web page has this container and inside this container you can use rows and columns and this is what makes the basis of grid system in bootstrap so let's try to add some rows and columns inside our container here so i have a little uh, sample for you how you can add the rows and columns inside your container div element so I have told you last time that you can add as many as rows you want in a web page. So there is no restriction on adding the number of rows. And how you can add these rows? You can just add this div element and take this class called a row and then it will add this row to your container. Okay and you can add multiple rows. So for example, I will just add some paragraph here, random paragraph, and I will save this, and I will run my web page, and in here I can see this row is added, and I can add as many number of rows as I want. So one row below other row below other, okay? so. You can add, you know, you can copy and paste something like this and it will add as many rows as you want. So I will save this and run it and it adds rows like this. Okay. Now in order to add columns, you need to do inside the row. Okay. So for example, I will delete all the rows except for one and in here I want to add a column okay so how you do this you did do this like this so this class you need to import which is which start from col and then comes some wildcard or asterisk which you can uh, change or which uh, you have multiple options for so for the first asterisk after this column comes the size uh, of this column and uh, it depends on the device you want to use or device on which you want to use this column for example you want to use it on uh, phones then you use access instead of this asterisk so for example for phone you use access or if you want to use it for tablet you change it with sm if you want to use for uh, desktop of uh, normal size then you use md and if you want to use it for larger desktop then you use lg okay and the next asterisk is the column number for example we want to uh, add some columns so uh, the, we already uh, you know have discussed that maximum number of columns we can add to our web page is 12 in bootstrap right so you can just say it can be of uh, six size so whatever number you write here it will take it as number of columns okay so for example i write is here six it will take it as six columns so let's make it for desktop here and i'm going to just copy this and paste it inside my row okay and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to add this paragraph once again inside this column div. Okay, so inside this column div, I'm going to paste this paragraph and I'm going to save it and run it once again. And you can see it captures or it uh, takes the half the size of uh, your page width. Okay, so for example, I give here 12 maximum 12 I can give 
as the column uh, you know number of columns right and i refresh my web page it takes the whole width like uh, the row okay and when i do something like for example two number of columns is equal to two it takes two columns here so like this okay so you can vary this number from 1 to 12 okay so for 12 it will be maximum and for 1 it will be minimum like this now you can add multiple columns inside your row for example i want to add some more columns for example three columns and first first column i give the width of two second column i give the width of four and third column i give the width of six for example so total of uh, these columns is 12 2 plus 4 plus 6 is equal to 12 right and i will refresh my page and you can see this is equal to two columns this is equal to four columns and this is equal to six columns okay or what you can do is you can do something like four four and four it depends upon you the size you can vary so 444 four, four will be equal for uh, you know our text 1 and text 2 and text 3 are all equal okay or you can vary 1 and 8 and 3 for example okay save it refresh the page and it's going to take the width as you specified right so in this way you can uh, use rows and column in your uh, bootstrap one more thing you for example you want to add one more row containing these columns you can just copy this row for example and you can add multiple rows something like this okay and when i refresh this it will give you three columns from first row other three columns from second row and other three columns from third row so in this way you can use rows and columns in bootstrap i hope you have enjoyed this video please rate comment and subscribe and bye for now